with uh, Samini this morning. And Samini campaigns for votes as he pegs forms to contest as Gimpa SRC president. Uh, Samini has added student politics to the many things he has been up to. And he says, I, Emmanuel Andrew Samini, popularly known as Samini, uh, picked up forms to stand for Gimpa SRC presidency, uh, he said in a video recorded on campus. So we bring a massive change and also continue the wonderful work that's I, Emmanuel Andrew Samini, popularly known as Samini, picked up forms to stand for GIMPA SRC presidency. And if all things go well and I'm approved, I'll be going for the elections coming few days' time. And I urge all of you to come out in your numbers to vote for me. So we bring a massive change and also continue the wonderful work that's and that's Amini on his way to causing a massive change in the campus of Gimpa. And, uh, well, he's been doing some few stuff with Coco Valley as well. And I'm sure that the two of them will be able to pull this through. Now, let's go on to talk about Stonewall's wife who celebrates five years in marriage. And uh, reggae dancer artist uh, Stonewall and his beautiful dentist wife, uh, Dr. Louisa, have made it to a year five of their marriage and in celebration of the anniversary the singer's wife has taken to social media to share an exclusive video that shows uh, some very cozy moments uh, with uh, her husband the couple are celebrating their fifth wedding anniversary with a video uh, college of some of their very best moments together All right, so that's Stonewall and the wife. Uh, some very, very cozy moments over there. And, uh, well, congratulations to them. Five years. And uh, we, we, we pray for them. You know, more years ahead. Uh, those of us who are just about starting to, we are praying for ourselves. Uh, Kwame Eugene cautions lookalikes against impersonating him for money. Multiple award-winning artist Kwame Eugene has communicated his dislike for lookalikes uh, who tend to impersonate him for monetary purposes. According to the, uh, the uh, hing, uh, singer, and it's appreciative uh, to have young people aspire to be like you. However, it is uh, an issue when people take advantage of this uh, flatter uh, for their monetary gains. Now, he asserted that it's criminal for someone to take advantage of other people's work and intellectual property and these lookalikes have been everywhere like from Kim Promise to Kwame Eugene to Kitty uh, to Kwesi I mean yeah, they are everywhere and I don't know how they, they do this uh, I don't know what what you know all this happens like I don't know how it happens and all of that but it looks like we're, we're not going to end you know this lookalikes like just recently I think about two days or so ago I saw Shatawali's lookalike as well and who's been giving birth to these people, man? <laughs> like, we, we need to find out. There's so much look like these guys. And I've been asking, look at them in, on your screens right now. There's so much look like them. Who has been giving birth to them? I don't know. Anyway, let's move on to talk about Mecca and uh, It says more women now abuse men. Uh, uh, you may argue, but, well, popular Nigerian movie star, Emeka Aike, has uh, stated that lately more men suffer domestic abuse than women. Uh, according to him, women are more manipulative in relationships, and in recent times, uh, they tend to abuse their partners more. Uh, the A-list actor argued that most women now enter marriages devoid of love and simply for money. According to Emeka, whose earlier marriage ended up on a nasty note, women nowadays would go the extra mile in making the lives of their husbands miserable or even try to kill them. The 55-year-old veteran actor further disclosed that he was a victim of domestic abuse, adding that he would have been dead if not for God's intervention. And uh, Emeka is 55 years. So just, uh, just yesterday, you know, we're watching him, you know, in his prime, doing what he does best, uh, Ramsey Noah and the likes. Uh, so I'm thinking, how old is Ramsey? How old is uh, Genevieve? Oh, okay. All right, so that's going to be all for what's training this morning.